Io sono Gambiano. Io sono Gabriel. Welcome back to another video, wherever you are. Special greetings to you. And don't forget, if today is your first time, please do me a favor by subscribing to the channel. Also, don't forget to hit on the notification bell whenever we draw video. You will be the first person to be notified and know what the video is all about. On this channel, we give you information and updates about migrants and also the latest update around the globe. But in today's video, we are going to be talking about the number of migrants that have arrived in Italy so far in 2022, estimated, estimated by Luciana Lamorgese, that is the interior minister of Italy. And also one Gambian immigrant has turned to be Italian teacher who is teaching refugees or asylum seekers who are coming from Ukraine. And it is very interesting. We are going to be talking about that story too. So guys, without wasting much time, let's do this thing together. Yeah, as I said before, Luciana Lamorgese has dropped the estimate or the number of migrants who have arrived in Italy so far in 2022. And the number is very, very fair. And even if you look at, we are in April now, and then if you see that number, that means at the end of the year, the number of migrants that she is going to carry is not going to be small thing. They said migrants, 6,700 sea arrivals, in Italy in 2022, and we are on the fourth month of 2022. They said in 2022, a reported 6,701 migrants arrived in Italy from the Mediterranean. Around half were rescued at sea, and the other half landed on their own. Interior Minister Luciana Lamorgese warns that arrivals could increase due to a food crisis in countries of departures caused by the war in Ukraine. A reported of 6,701 migrants have reached Italy from the Mediterranean in 2022. Interior uh, Minister Luciana Lamorgese told Parliament's Schengen Committee on Wednesday, 30th, Wednesday March 30th. They included 3,322 people who were rescued at sea and 3,378 through autonomous landing. Those rescued at the sea included 1,595 1, persons who were rescued by private NGOs. Lamorgese recalled that the majority uh, countries to depart from Libya, that is 4,236, and Tunisia, 1,494. Although lately, pressure from these two countries has reportedly decreased. The minister then warn about a likely food crisis caused by the conflict in Ukraine since countries like Tunisia uh, import wheat from Ukraine and Russia. This could have an impact on migration flows, noted the interior minister. 475 unaccompanied minors have arrived from Ukraine. On the topic of unaccompanied Ukraine minors in Italy, the minister said that there are currently 475 in Italy, uh, including 244 girls and 231 boys. 38 of them were below the age of 5, said Lamorgese. She explained that out of the 475 minors, 344 are in families author are authorized by a minor court and 94 in authorized, in authorized facilities. The highest number is in Toscany, that is 96 followed by the Veneto, 78, Lombardy, 67, Emilia Romagna, 48, and, uh, and Piemonte, that is 39. Now, they said the Italian legislation, the minister said, does not allow to consider family and friends as guidance. Therefore, it is necessary to apply to minors, court to recognize a person accompanying a minor as a guidance she explained so so far you can see the number of people who are arriving and now since uh tunisia is is importing wheat from uh ukraine and russia it may lead to the flow of the uh, of ukraine uh, of tunisia migrants in the country or people who are in tunisia tunisia people will allow them to come because if there is food crisis in the country even luciana lamorgese herself know that the number of migrants that will be landing in the country 
it's not going to be a joke so you can see uh, we are on the fourth month of 2022 and you can see the number of migrants that has entered the country so far and those and this was just by the way and now let's move on to the next story if you go down there to Catania you know there are a lot of migrants asylum seekers refugees coming from Ukraine now there is one Gambian guy who started teaching these Ukraine migrants or refugees, teaching them the language Italiano. You see, that is why sometimes I tell you that learning the language is very, very important. Because people wouldn't, wouldn't even believe that someone who came by sea, someone who passed through Mediterranean Sea, as they always say, that the salt water has eaten our brain. Not knowing that the salt water has eaten, but... Thank God, it has, it has living some, some mind, some brain, some knowledge for us. Now, if you see the way this Gambian guy is teaching this Ukraine migrants, uh, Italiano guys, I said you clap for them. These are the kind of things that if we are doing in the country, we need to share so that Italians will know that we are not only here, like the way some of them say we are here to sell drugs, we are here to steal their jobs. Meanwhile, we are not here doing that. This guy is saying he came, they rescued him, they did everything for him. So why is it that if he knows how to, how to speak the language, he will not help another people or others to do what to also learn the language. But quickly, let's watch the video. When we are back, we will give you the rest of the app so stay tuned io sono gambiano io sono gambiano lezione prima verbo essere il più usato nella lingua italiana con tono spassoso Ebrahim mi insegna ciò che ha da poco imparato a scuola e ad ascoltarlo i volti di un paese in fuga noi quando siamo arrivati qua siamo stati accol uh, accolti con le braccia aperte e anche noi vorremmo fare lo stesso per gli altri. Lungo la spiaggia che porta a Catania, la colonia Don Bosco, la solidarietà mostra il suo volto migliore. Quella di esuli che aiutano altri esuli, con la complicità che può avere solo chi, in passato, ha vissuto la stessa solitudine. Ti manca la terra, la felicità, l'aria che respiri, eh, la tua cultura, i tuoi amici, i familiari. Ti manca tante cose perché non c'è un posto come la, 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 la propria terra. Saranno famiglie siciliane ad accogliere Carina e gli altri. Sono arrivati qui dopo un viaggio di 34 ore dalla Polonia. Su quel pullman erano in 50, per lo più donne e bambini, insieme a tre cani e due gatti. Tatiana ci mostra le immagini dei rifugi sotterranei. 25 giorni passati a sentire il frastuono delle bombe cadute su Kharkiv. Adesso mi sento al sicuro, dice. Ho trovato un luogo che protegge me e i miei figli. I bisogni sono gli stessi, no? si è centrati sulla persona, non ci sono rifugiati di serie A, rifugiati di serie B. I bisogni sono altro, e per essere costruttori di pace è necessaria una condizione, aprire il cuore. I hope you have seen the video. This migrant also passed through Mediterranean Sea, like the way you pass through Mediterranean Sea. But day in, day out, you said the language is very difficult. You cannot learn. You have your phone. You go to YouTube. You go to TikTok. You go to Facebook. I am not telling you not to go to YouTube. N either, neither I'm telling you to go, not to go to uh, Facebook or WhatsApp or TikTok. You can just use your phone to learn this language. Do you remember the, la the last time your lawyer told you to look for a translator? Do you know? Do you remember how much you pay the translator? What of if, like, you understand the language, would you have paid that money to the translator? But since you don't want to learn, you said the language is difficult. Always, you have to look for translators, and they will collect your money because the translator will not leave his or her job and come and translate for you unless you pay him. You understand? So let's try to learn the language because it is very, very important. If you don't even want to use it, learn it when you are going back to your country. If you reach their airport, leave the language for them and go to your own country. You don't have any problem. But so far as we are in the country, please, we need to try to learn the language. So, bro, wherever you are, big ups to you. I really like what you are doing because these are the kind of things we need to do in the country and we need to show them that we are also doing amazing job in the country so and this is the update i have for you today the name remains official cracker fact news if you have not subscribed yet please what are you waiting for subscribe to the channel and be part of the family until we meet again in the next video please stay safe and stay blessed peace out